Welcome to two hours of continuing education. What you need to know about a second home, vacation homes, and timeshares. That is what this course will be covering today. The course outline is pretty simplistic. We are going to go through a couple different topics. We're going to talk about the pros and cons of actually owning a second home or a vacation property. We're going to talk about how you can build a business around resort housing. We're going to talk about the lifestyle market and the creation of the lifestyle market for the second homes. We're going to talk about how you as a real estate professional can help your clients make the right decisions when they do decide to buy that second property or vacation home. We're going to talk a little bit about the tax treatment. Understand I'm not a CPA nor an attorney, but we'll talk a little bit about the taxation of the second home or the vacation property. Then we're going to deal a little bit about the marketing to get these buyer clients and the marketing mix that you should use as an active real estate professional. Talk a little bit about the trends and the issues of this type of market, and then we're gonna recap and uh, allow for some questions and answering here, all right? Now, the real, real estate market's a lot bigger than just your local market. A lot of agents all the time are talking about, well, our market or my market, but understand that in this shrinking world that we live in, there are many buyers now that are choosing a vacation home or a second home or even a timeshare in a completely separate or different market than the one they primarily live in. Timeshares are growing in popularity. Matter of fact, I actually own a timeshare in Orlando, Florida, and a lot of the retirees are using their uh, money they've accumulated over the years to buy this second home. And we actually have a word for these. You guys have all heard of the word snowbirds. So there is a large population that does split their time amongst their primary market and potentially a secondary market. market. <clears throat> so this course, we're going to talk a little bit about the essentials and the differing qualities and aspects and reasons why a person would buy or sell and how they could manage their second home. Um, so these are the topics that we are going to be covering during this course. All right. So that's the end of this module. Let's move on.